Who from Marauders Vehicle? Today is Friday, December the 7th. I'm Sienna. And I'm Hayden, and here's an announcement from Marauders Miracle. Hi guys, today was the last day of Marauders Miracle, and we wanted to thank you for all the stuff that you guys brought in throughout the week. We felt some overwhelming support, and stay tuned for the announcements later today, and we'll be announcing our winner then. Thank you, Marauders! Thank you. <laughs> Good morning, Banting. I'm Hayden. And I'm Avery. And here are your morning announcements. This is the last announcement to inform you we now have green bins located throughout the school. Please remember to put your organics, like food waste, into the green bins and not the garbage. Organics will be composted using a new indoor process that will produce fertile soil to be sold at the horticulture sale in May. Also, make sure Tim's cups go in the garbage and Tim's lids go in the recycling. Yearbooks go up in price in seven days, so please do not delay your purchase. All sales to purchase 2018-2019 yearbooks are finished as of January 28th. Go to School Cash Online or see Miss Meadows in room 182 during lunch or after school. Only one week left grads to submit your baby pictures for the yearbook. Submissions close December 21st, no exceptions. Get them in as today so you don't miss the deadline. Send it to banyearbook at scudsby.owen.ca or in person to Miss Meadows in room 182. Come on down to the cafeteria today at lunch for the open mic and paint party. You can watch performances, perform yourself, be a part of a collaborative art project, or just enjoy the artsy atmosphere. There is something for everyone, so we hope to see you there. Attention, the Gender and Sexuality Alliance will have their Festivus celebration Thursday at lunch. Bring food if you have it, but there will also be food provided. The Mobus RV, a youth walk-in clinic, is here today and every Friday from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. outside the cafeteria. Are you concerned about birth control, STDs, or pregnancy, feeling down, anxious, coping with drugs or alcohol? Maybe you have a sore throat or another injury. Whatever your concerns are, we are here to help. Services are confidential and geared for youth aged 12 to 25. The team includes a mental health worker and peer support specialist, and students can drop in or book their appointment at any time. The junior boys basketball team played their second game of the season last night. The boys had strong defense and offense in the first half of the game, but lost to Collingwood. The team takes on Nantire next week, next Tuesday the 11th here at Banting. There is a practice today in the gym at 4.30. And now here are a couple clips from basketball. Y'all open. Dance team will continue to have practices Monday at lunch and Thursdays after school. Please let Ms. Donor know if you cannot make practices, you can find her in room 130. Please make sure you bring in your permission forms as soon as possible. Yesterday, the boys hockey team won their game against Bradford. Here are some pictures from the game. <laughs> <laughs> now here's a video from CTV about our clothing tribe. 
Welcome back. Jane joins us now with a look around the region and we start with a growing trend. It's happening at more local high schools because what's old is new again. Used clothing is being resold, refurbished or donated as a way for students to reconnect with each other and their environment. CTV's Krista Sharp reports. Can you fit into a lady's style? What's old is new again. Oh my God, it fits perfect. A used clothing store has opened inside Aurelia Secondary School. Thrift store is cool. Like, I just think it's really cool and it's a new way to, like, bring um, a story back to old clothes. It all started with the fashion and design class, but many others have since joined. Business students work on marketing, and a science class helps with fiber recycling. They break it all down, they cut up all the fibers, and they use it as uh, replacement fibers for other products like seat fillers and stuffing. In Alliston, Banting Memorial is getting ready to open a similar store. Both schools donating profits to local charities. One hope is to give teens a better understanding of commercialism and the impact of fast fashion. If we can make used or secondhand clothing more popular, then we can take that stuff out of the landfills and we can have like a whole new wardrobe. It brings everyone together that wouldn't normally work together. You fold this way. As they prepare to open, students from all different grades and backgrounds you're unfold it, then you're gonna fold it, okay? Ultimately teaching each other important life skills. What'd you learn? How to fold. If you'd like to donate, both schools are accepting donations from the public. A used clothing program that helps to hang up both stigma and, of course, excessive clothes. Krista Sharp, CTV News, Alliston. That's great. That's great. And now over to Tiana with the weather. Right now it's negative 13 degrees. Your quote of the day is, prove them wrong. Today is National Cotton Candy Day. I mean, we have a few announcements today. First, first up, French Club. Hey, hey, Banting, are you looking to improve your French, meet new people, and eat some good food? Then come on out to Room 15 today at lunch for French Club every Friday. Salut, Banting. Cherchez-vous une façon d'améliorer votre français oral, de rencontrer les nouveaux amis et d'essayer de bonnes rituels? Venez nous le jeune. The joint up for the club francophone are banting as a distant can shack vendre the pendant l'heure de lunch. Merci et bon journée. Next up is Banting Madness. Hey Banting, we're here from Banting Madness and we want to let you know the game times for today at uh, the big gym for lunch. So at 10.50 we have Toon Squad versus the Hot Shots. At 11.10 uh, we have Hit Squad versus Nothing But Net. And 11.30, we have Hoops I Did It Again versus 2C Sits. Thank you. See you there. And now back to the main host with the birthdays. Happy birthday to... Alessandra Kermi. Eliz Belinda. Jasper Brown. Sarah Canole. Conley. Conley. And, and Dan Donald Nickel. Saturday birthdays are... Megan Plant. Sarah Botting. Brooke McPherson. Spencer Smart. Isabel Carbonell. Charbonneau. Charbonneau. Yeah. Sorry. David Van E. Um, and Brennan. And Sunday Lovichek. birthdays are. <laughs> Samaya said. Carmen Spilner. Carly Stevenson. And Sierra Monroe. <laughs> That's all for your morning announcements, Banting. Be sure to like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And tune in Monday for, for the next live stream. Have a great day.